YouTube, what's going on? It's Uncle Tone 99 it's Tony. How you guys doing? Today we're going to have an unboxing for you guys of Mom's new laptop. Uh, this isn't mine. Mom's, uh, you know, having a little trouble sitting at the desktop and stuff now. It bothers her back and her neck a little bit. So uh, we decided we don't need the big machine anymore. We're going to get rid of that. We picked her up a laptop. Uh, this is nothing particularly fancy. This is the new uh, 2010 Inspiron Dell, Inspiron 1545. Um, just the base model, we didn't do anything fancy here, but the, mo uh, the most processor intensive application she runs is like Photoshop. That's about it. So nothing super fancy, this is the basic model. Uh, the 1545, it's got the uh, Windows 7 64-bit. Uh, Duo processor T4400, I believe, at 2.26 gigahertz. So it's a dual core, 2.26 gigahertz. Four gigs of RAM, uh, 320 gig hard drive, and 128 megs integrated graphics. So uh, nothing particularly fancy. Picked it up for $4.99 directly from Dell. It was $4.99 plus, you know, taxes and so on and so forth all that wonderful stuff that adds another hundred bucks to the price but we'll go ahead and we'll do a quick unboxing here for you guys I don't know if you guys are really into this stuff or not but you know I did an unboxing of my laptop back when I got it and uh, it's got a bunch of views and people really seem to be into it so we're gonna go ahead and do an unboxing on this one there we go we got the tape cut as you can see I just cut that haven't opened this up yet so inside we get what do we get inside? We get cardboard, right on. We get cardboard. Down the side here, we get a bunch of manuals. Down the side, you got uh, a Ziploc bag. What do we got in here? We got your drivers and utilities. Uh, applications already installed on your computer. Uh, blah 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 form this uh, create system recovery media uh, well I'm dropping everything now uh, your owner's manual quick start guide reinstalling Windows 7 all uh, mumble jumbo papers it comes with warranty and support safety environmental regulations blah 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 whatever then you got your Inspiron setup guide owner's manual Wajimajubi cool beans okay down the side here you got your power brick which is smaller than mine mine is much bigger for my studio laptop this one is smaller same jack but this is smaller than my studio power brick and then you got your other connector plugs in the power brick and that's all you got down the side you lift off the cardboard eggshell tight material and inside you got your laptop anything else in there? I didn't see a Windows 7 CD in there anywhere I don't include Windows 7 reinstallation CD or Shouldn't there be something like that on there? I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm unboxing this for the first time here with you guys. And it doesn't appear that we got a Windows 7 reinstallation disk. So I'm going to have to call them and tell them that's missing and get them to send one of those out because we should have got that with the machine. And we didn't. So that's missing. So I'm gonna have to call them and let them know. Cool beans. And then here we have the laptop itself inside this plastic bag. Open it up. And inside you've got your Dell Inspiron 15 laptop. Uh, it looks pretty nice. What do we got here on the side? We got. Uh,
All right, what do we got here on the side? We got your power, uh, Kensington lock. Nobody ever uses those. I don't anyway. Two USBs, a VGA port, a Ethernet port. That's all you got on this side. Uh, on the front, you've got some headphone jacks and an SD card reader. Pretty cool. A headphone jack, microphone jack, and an SD card reader. On the other side, you've got uh, an express card slot and a tray loading CD, uh, DVD drive, and another USB. So, pretty cool. Let's pop it open, see what it looks like on the inside. There you go. Looks pretty nice, pretty decent. I think Mum will be pretty happy with it. It's lighter than my studio, definitely. I like the hinge a little better too, to be honest with you. It's a nice hinge. I like that a little bit better than my studio hinge. But uh, there you go, keyboard feels pretty much the same. It's not backlit. I got the backlit keyboard on mine. She doesn't have backlit. But uh, you know, this is just the basic entry model job. And I just turned it on. So there you go, I didn't intend to, but apparently that's the power button. So I just turned it on and it's now starting Windows. So cool beans, we're gonna have to go through the whole setup thing and all that sort of stuff, get it started and set up and so on and so forth and uh, do that with mom. And uh, there you go guys, that's pretty much it. So that's the Dell Inspiron 1545 laptop. Uh, basic entry metal, entry level unit. Um, everything looks like it's here, it looks pretty cool. Except for the fact that we are missing the Windows 7 reinstallation DVD. Which I suppose is not a big deal, I'll have to call them, let them know it was missing, get them to send me one out. But uh, other than that, that's pretty much it guys. Nothing super fancy, just, you know, nice machine, let mom do what she needs to do. She mostly does, you know, email, web, uh, you know, email, internet, uh, little Photoshop stuff. That's pretty much all she does, so she doesn't need anything super fancy. She doesn't do any gaming or video editing or, excuse me, anything like that like I do. So this will do just fine, and she picked the black. She, uh, she likes the black, so she went ahead and picked the black. So, uh... There you go. It does come in a bunch of colors, but she went ahead and picked the black. So there you go. Pretty cool beans. So we're going to go through the whole setup thing with mom and get it all set up. And uh, hopefully she likes it. All right. Cool beans. Thanks for watching, guys. This has been the Inspiron 1545 2010 model unboxing. And uh, hopefully this helps you guys out. You're thinking about getting an Inspiron. Um, it looks pretty decent. Pretty decent, pretty nice looking machine. So, uh, you know, for $4.99, uh, certainly better than a netbook. Um, we were considering a netbook, but the thing was, you know, she, uh, her, she's not getting any younger, and her, her eyes, you know, she can't see the uh, small little 10-inch netbook screen. For 100 bucks more, we got this. So, uh, this will do perfectly. So, that's it, guys. I've rambled on long enough. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon. Rock on.